But the way that I started presenting at the National Groundwater Association was by a, a lady by the name of Kathy Butcher. Kathy caught me at one of our uh, groundwater, um, it, it wasn't the groundwater week, it was at the uh, summit. And she was walking around and said, somebody uh, didn't show up. I said, Kathy, I've got a presentation on my computer that I can give that'll take this 15 or 20 minutes. And she goes, you're on. And so after that, Kathy kind of roped me in to hey, saying, hey, would you like to go ahead and present at a conference we got coming up? And she got me involved. And be before that, I really didn't know anything about being on a committee, uh, you know, serving on the board, but, but she was a big advocate for the NGWA. And so I, you know, I was already coming to some of the conferences, but I wasn't involved. I was coming for my CEUs. And uh, once I got involved and in meeting the people, meeting everybody that was like me, the real, real people with a passion for groundwater, it got me more motivated to teach and to, to help educate. And uh, I don't look at myself as a professional in any, any way, shape or form, but I've made a lot of mistakes and I know the mistakes I've made and I don't want other people that have to go through the same mistakes that I made. Uh, and then uh, Todd Hunter was the president. Todd came from town right next to me. We're good friends. And Todd asked me if I would get on the board. And uh, so some, with the help of some of the ex-presidents, or past presidents, not ex, uh, past presidents, and with Todd, I went ahead and uh, uh, ran for the board position. My first time, I failed. I, I mean, I shouldn't say failed, but I didn't get it. I came back and went for it again, and uh, was elected to the board, and what a blessing it's been. The people that I've met here, has, it's been outstanding. I walk down the hall and I, I can only walk about 10 feet. There's somebody that I know, somebody that's saying, hey, you know, this is, is what we're doing. What are you doing? You know, it's that network uh, collaboration that we have here of one big family. The NGWA members is just one great big family. And I, I love it. I encourage everybody to get involved if they can through, you know, into the NGWA through committees. We have a lot of working committees, whether it be the awards committee, uh, membership committee. Uh, I mean, there, there, we have lots and lots of different committees, uh, PFAS, MAR. Uh, so if, if people want to get involved with the National Groundwater Association, that's a great place to start. And they can come to any of the past presidents. They can come to any of the board members they see walking the floor and just ask us, what do I have to do to become a member? And we would be glad, or not a member, but a uh, committee member. And we'd be glad to get you involved in a committee. Uh, also, you get involved in the committee, the next step is to become a board member. And if you wanna have some say in how the association is run, some, some say and in influence in, the, in our industry, get involved. That's what it takes. We need the young people involved in this association. So please get involved.